Okay, we have MTAP Division Orals Reviewer for Elementary with complete solution and explanation. So, before we start, eh, sa mga hindi pa po nakasubscribe, please click the like, subscribe, and the bell button for more videos and for more MTAP Reviewer. Okay, guys, let's, um, let's have the first question. What is 14 more than 1 half of 60? So, this is the solution. Ang una muna natin gagawin, kukunin muna natin yung 1 half ng 60. So, 1 half times 60 equals 60 over 2. 60 divided by 2 now is equal to 30. And then, based on the given problem, we have 14 more than. So, 14 more than means plus 14. So, we're going to add 30 and 14. So, 30 plus 14 is equal to 44. Okay, next, let's have number 2. What number is missing in 7, 11, 15, blank, 23, and 27? So, the, the solution is to observe the pattern. If you're going to observe the pattern, nag a tayo ng 4 bawat term. Okay, so 7 plus 4 is 11. 11 plus 4 is 15. And then, 23 plus 4 is 27. So, meaning, we're going to add 4 doon sa 15. So, 15 plus 4 equals 19. Therefore, the answer is 19. That is the missing number. Okay, number 3. How many more 6 eights than 6 fives? Okay, so this is the solution. 6 eights is equivalent to 6 times 8 and it is equal to 48. 6 fives, so anim na 5, that is 6 times 5 equals 30. And then we have to subtract. 48 minus 30 equals 18. Okay, next we have number 4. What is left if you take away 6 eighths from 60? So the first step is to find 6 eighths. So meaning we have 6 times 8 equals 48. If you're going to take away, ibig sabihin in the list, then we have to subtract or minus. So 60 minus 48 equals 12. And we vote a cup of noodles for 18 pesos and a sandwich for 12 pesos. How much change did he get from his 50 pesos? Okay, so meron siya 50 pesos and then um, bumili siya ng 18 pesos worth ng noodles and then 12 pesos na sandwich. So the solution is, i-add natin yung dalawa na binili niya which is 18 pesos plus 12 pesos equals 30 pesos. Yun yung binili niya. And then how much change ang magkano yung sukli niya from the 50 pesos? Then, ang gagawin natin, 50 pesos minus the 30 pesos. The answer is 20 pesos. Yun yung um, sukli niya o natira sa kanya. Okay, now number 6. A cake was divided into 24 equal pieces. One half of the cake and four more pieces were eaten by Jessica's friends. How many pieces remain? So, if it is divided to 24 equal pieces, Parts and one half of the cake is so ang gagawin natin one half of the cake times the 24 so one half times 24 equals 24 over 2 24 divided by 2 equals 12 okay and then based on the given problem four more pieces is four so ang gagawin natin i-add natin yung half ng cake and then yung apat na Peraso na kinain pa. So, 12 plus 4 is 16. Okay, and then yun yung i-subtract so natin sa kabuan, which is yung kabuang pieces is 24. So, 24 minus 16 equals 8. So, 8 na lang yung natirang pieces ng cake. Number 7. What is N if 41 plus N equals 35 plus 19? Okay, ito yung solution natin. 41 plus N equals 54. Because 35 plus 19 is equal to 54. And then, to solve for N, um, we're going to subtract for 54 and 41. So, 54 minus 41 is 13. Therefore, N is equal to 13. Okay, number 8. 
Five papayas are each cut into eights. How many pieces are there? So, ang gagawin natin, we're going to multiply five papayas into eight cuts. So, five times eight equals forty. Number nine. What number is midway between 21 and 37? When we say midway, um, in between or half or kalahate. So, this is the solution. Ia-add natin yung 21 at saka yung 37. 21 plus 37 is 58. And then, di-divide natin sa dalawa. So, 58 divided by 2 equals 29. So, that is the midway between 21 and 37. Okay, we have number 10. If there are 10 fives and 50, how many fives are there in 85? Um, fives ng 50 is 10. So, therefore, dinibide natin yun sa 5. 50 divided by 5 equals 10. Um, in 85 naman, i-divide natin siya sa 5. 85 divided by 5, the answer is 17. Therefore, we have 17 fives in 85. Okay, that's all for now, guys. Thank you for watching. So, please click the like, subscribe, and the bell button for more videos or for more MTOP reviewers. Thank you so much.